go. What is new, YouTube? It's Moose here, bringing you guys a, another Black Ops 3 video. And today is actually a zombies video, which I don't do much of, but when I do, you know it's gonna be a good one. Now, right now, what my plan is, I think I have a, almost five zombie videos that I wanna put out here really quickly that I've been working on. So be on the lookout for those, but this one by far is my favorite, and I haven't seen anyone else do this yet on YouTube. So on the very new DLC number two zombie map, said Subu no Shima, however you say it, there is a glitch where you cannot die, which totally is bringing me back to the World at War days where there was glitches, you'd get the flamethrower, you'd never die, it was the most boring thing ever, but it was absolutely hilarious and a lot of people love to do it. So I'm gonna make this short and sweet so you guys know what's going on, so you guys can do it yourself, but there is gonna be a little bit of map awareness of the new map so you guys know where this is going on at. So it all revolves around the very middle bunker door or the power door, whatever you wanna call it, right in the middle of the map basically. And if you're facing that door a little bit to the left, there's actually a little patch of dirt where you can plant one of the seeds. If you guys don't know how to do that, you pick up seeds from zombies that you kill and you can plant them in certain dirt spots around the map. And once that flower actually blooms or wherever you want to call it, you could actually jump on top of it. Now it's one of the only ones you can do that, I believe. We're trying to jump on top of some other flowers, but you just can't do it. But because of how the ground is laid out in this area, if you run along the wall and jump, you will be able to just jump right on top of this flower. So make sure you don't harvest it. But once you're on top of the flower, that's it. They cannot get you. The zombies will run around you. They will like look like they're stunned. They cannot hit you. But there is many downsides to this. One, the really big guys, they can hit you off of it. And two, the spiders will be able to shoot their webs at you. But this is just the first part of it. There's more to it. So as you guys can see right here, I was playing with four people. So two of the guys actually got right behind me in this little corner. You can see this little crack. And if you push yourself far enough into that little corner there, you also will not get hit by the zombies. So up to three people can be free of getting hit by the zombies. The zombies will be so focused on the guy on the flower that they won't even try to go for the guys behind him. But there are some rare occurrences where if you step off the wall or if a zombie's coming straight from your left, they will still try to hit you. So you're not 100% free of the zombies. Also, if the bunker door is open, then you cannot sit behind it. The zombies will get right to you. But you can still stand on top of the flower. That works all the time, except like I said, for spider rounds and the big guys. One of my friends was literally just running and just happened to jump jump and land on top of the flower and we were like this cannot be this simple but it really was so very simple but awesome glitch i hope you guys do enjoy please click that like button down below if you do so if you guys have not already thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys later